Hey guys, welcome to another episode of PC Building Simulator. Hope you're having a wonderful day today. Oh man, oh man. In northern Utah where I live, it has decided to finally get hot. I mean like real hot. Like we've been in the 90 degree area, Fahrenheit obviously, 90 degrees. Not too bad. We have very low humidity here, so when it's 90 something, it feels 90 something outside. But Friday and Saturday... Friday and Saturday is supposed to hit 100. I'm not looking forward to that. I don't like it when it gets that hot. It's not fun to go outside, even though my house is air conditioned. But the walk from my condo to the car, and then you got to cool the car off. Ugh. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. All right, guys. I'm going to stop my rant. Let's get into our email. Let's see what we have going on. Let's do this one, it's due in two days. As my friend said, you work with computers, so I need some repairs done. When I hit the power, I smelled burning. Now it just won't turn on. I'm gonna need it in two days at the latest. Is it okay, it's so dusty. Do you like cable modding? I saw some great plastic white pink ones the other day. Plastic white pink ones. All right, I don't even know if I have those. I don't know. Let's let's actually go to the shop. Let's take a look. Plastic white pink. Patterned or striped? It didn't say. Plastic white pink ones. Hmm. Well, let's get them both. Why not? Why not? So he needs a CPU and hard drive replaced. We can definitely do that for him. Let's go ahead, let's accept that one. I think there were some other ones. This one's due in two days. It says, hello, this is embarrassing, but I need something repaired. I was experimenting and well, I don't think I'll do it again. So can you do that in two days? I read the MSI parts are really good. If you can, I'd love some plastic orange cables in there. We do have plastic orange. We do. We do. Man, big budget. $1,200 for repair. Replace the RAM and the graphics card. We can definitely make that happen as well. Let's go ahead and accept that one. And then let's do a build. This one here will work. It says, you work with computers, right? Would you be able to build me a new computer? It has to get 10,584 in benchmarks, okay? I've got to have it in nine days too. And AO water cooler would give me some headroom for overclocking later on. My brother has colorful in his PC. He says they're the best. I worry about used parts. Azuka. Well, Azuka, we're not going to put any used parts in that PC for you, but we are going to put as many things from Colorful as we possibly can. Let's go ahead and accept that one. I'm going to step away. I'm going to get some parts put in the shopping cart for this build, and I'll be right back. For this build, we're going to go with the cover Colorful. I can't even talk. Colorful iGame Z390 Vulcan XV20. An i9-9900KS, 240mm AO water cooler, four sticks of Corsair Vengeance. It's 8 gig, 3200MHz, a colorful iGame RTX 2080 Ti, Silverstone, a 520 watt power supply, 2TB M.2 drive, a 1TB Seagate Barracuda. We're going to put four in-win Ego fans in there, and we're going to put all of that in the A-Data XPG Battlecruiser. I also went ahead and added... The parts we need for our repairs including a one terabyte hard drive that we needed for our repair as well so i'm gonna go ahead and buy all this stuff for next day delivery let's make sure make sure we accepted everything let's go into our day we can get in all our parts our repairs and we can get to work all right oh what did we get in looks like there's something there's a couple of things Three things from PC Bay. What else do we have here? What's this? Just a case? All right. Well, let's throw that in the closet. Let's see what we've got. Get this one. Oh. Oh, it's dusty. It's dusty. <laughs> let's get this one over here. And then we'll get our case. Not the first time I'm going to be building in this case as well. But let's get that case there. Let's grab our post-it note. Get that thing on the workbench. We can get started 
with this dusty, dusty case. Let's get this case taken apart a little bit so we can blast it with some air. Start getting the dust out of here. It's definitely dusty. I can already feel my allergies starting to kick up. There we go. There we go. That looks better. Let's check this side, make sure it got everything clean. I think we're good. So we need to replace the CPU on this. Let's get this CPU cooler out of the way. We get the CPU out of there. Let's do fits this PC. It's definitely broken. Let's sell it off. Get the six bucks. The six bucks is six bucks. Let's go ahead and put some thermal paste on that thing. We also need to replace their one terabyte hard drive. I think they wanted. I think they're the ones that wanted those crazy colored cables I had to buy too. So uh, let's grab. That's definitely broken. It's worth a buck. <laughs> it's worth a whole dollar. Let's go ahead and grab the new hard drive and get it in there. And we'll go ahead. What am I looking for? CPU cooler. Was this their CPU cooler? It must have been. It was down, down at the bottom of the list. So C Bronte. Let's let's double check and just make sure. They're the ones that wanted the plastic white pink cables. So let's remove all the cables. So we can replace all of them with plastic white pink. I just don't know which plastic white pink that they want. Okay, that's all the colored ones. So let's do pink. Patterned white pink. Striped white pink. I guess let's do the striped. I don't really know what the difference is. Let's get everything cabled back up. And we'll make sure everything boots and works properly. Hmm. Incomplete case. Well, that's fine. Let's hop into their BIOS real quick. Let's see if they've got XMP on or what they... Okay, let's turn XMP on for them for sure. Make sure we're booting from that SSD feel like it's going to say no OS. It does. Go figure. Go figure on that. Let's uh, quickly power cycle this. There we go. They're going to have a faster computer now. There we go. Okay. Let's get this case put back together. see and this handle whatever that does doesn't really look like a handle but looks more like it's just there to hold the curved glass on but hey whatever they want to call it this thing's done let's get it out in the hall we can get started on this next repair we need to replace the ram and the graphics card Oh, something's glitching through. <laughs> Some of the wires are glitching through there. Um, can we get to the RAM? Let's take their CPU cooler off. It'll just be easier. Let's get their RAM out of here. And let's see if it's actually broken. It is. And I bought the right thing. Perfect. Let's get that replaced. New RAM. And then we need to replace the graphics card. And then they wanted orange cables. Let's get this graphics card out of here. And let's disconnect anything that looks purple or pink. We can get the proper color in there. Not too many cables to replace because they have a non-modular power supply. 
Let's come down here. Sell that off for 22 bucks. We don't need a broken one in the inventory anyway. Let's get the working one installed. We'll get this cabled up. They wanted plastic orange cables. So I think it's these right here. They look yellow to me, but we'll call them orange. They're not going to get too many of them, though, because of their non-modular power supply. That's about it. Missing part. Oh, yeah. I've still got to put the CPU cooler on there. Let's get their cooler back on. Let's get that cabled up as well. There we go. Let's power this thing on. Let's hop into their BIOS. And we'll make sure that their XMP is on. Not that it's... Well, it'll make a little difference. Looks good. Let's let this thing boot. There we go. There we go. Let's get this case put back together. <laughs> Those wires. Wires coming through the side of the case. Get the side panels put on. We can get this thing out into the hallway. And we can get started on our build. Yes, we can. Okay, let's get the side panels taken off. I think we need to take most of this case apart, if I'm not mistaken. So I want to replace these fans. I don't care for the way they look. This nice white case. Let's get rid of these fans. We've got some other ones we're going to put in, in their place. That I think go a little bit nicer with this case. They're down here. They're the Inwin Ego. Maybe if I just type in Ego. Oh, I've got a lot of them. They're all new. Weird. Okay. Well, then we can use any of them. We just need to install four of them. Doesn't matter which ones. There we go. There we go. All four are installed. Okay. Okay, I think we're ready for the motherboard. We've got the colorful iGame Z390 Vulcan XV20. We'll get that all screwed down. There we go. I think we're going to put our graphics card here. So let's get that stuff out of our way. We got four sticks of RAM going in. Let's get these RAM clips open. Let's get this thing open for the CPU. Let's go ahead and get both of those parts installed. We've got the i9-9900KS. It's the 5 gigahertz on all core 9900K. Let's grab our memory as well. We've got four sticks of Corsair Vengeance. 8 gig, 3200 megahertz. We're going to get all of that installed as well. There we go. All right, next, let's get some storage in here before we get too far. Let's grab our Patriot Vite. Can it go under here? No, it can't. So we'll put it down there. And then we've got a one terabyte hard drive going in as well. So we'll grab that and get it installed. Do we have to remove something to get the power supply in or does it just somehow magically... Does it magically insert us? Uh, let's find out. Let's find out. We've got the Silverstone NJ520. It's just, it's magic. It's all magic. Okay. Get some thermal paste on the CPU, and we can go ahead and get the CPU cooler on there. We've got the GamerStorm Captain 240 EX in white. Let's get that installed. There we go. And then we can go ahead and grab our graphics card. We've got the colorful iGame 
RTX 2080 Ti Vulcan XOC. Let's get that installed. I think we're ready to cable this thing up. Let's get... Let's get some... Really like white and red. Do I not have any white and red? Got red, white, and blue. I should have ordered some white and red cables. I think that'd go good because there's some red on the case there. And I think some of this colorful stuff lights up red as well. You know what? Let's... Oops. Cables. White, red. Let's just get them both. Why not? Why not? Let's do same day delivery. Then we can see which one we like better in there. Now let's go here. Plastic white red. Plastic patterned white red. Okay, so that one looks like that. Let's see what the other one looks like. So is that one split and the other one? Okay, I like that better. I like that better. Get everything cabled up. While we're at it, this case has a whole lot of parts. Let's get some of those put back on as well. Does this PCI lock need to go? Yes, it does. Then we've got a top dust filter. We've got a top panel. And then I believe we've got a front dust filter. And then a front panel. That's probably good. Probably good for now. All right. Let's grab a USB drive. Let's power this thing up. We can hop into the BIOS. Make sure our XMP is turned on. Make sure we're booting from the right drive. We'll let this thing boot up and install the operating system. Okay. We need to run 3D Mark, so let's go ahead and get that on there. Let's get the lighting app on there as well. Okay. Yeah, we need to change some colors. Let's go into the lighting app. Let's just select everything. How does that look? I don't know that I like these fans in red. Let's change these fans back to white. Oh, I like that much better. I like that much better. So we need to get a 3D Mark score of 10,584. I'm going to get 3D Mark running. As soon as I get a score, I will come right back. So there it is, 12,182. We needed a 10,584. I think we're ready to get this case put back together. To get, I don't know which. Okay, that's this side panel. I'm gonna put them on wrong or something here. That's that side panel. Let's take a look at this thing. I think it turned out pretty nice. I like that white and red combination. Looks pretty dang good. To get this thing out in the hallway, let's collect some money. 
Let's get that store out of our way. Let's collect that one. Five stars. Excellent. Excellent. Let's collect this one. Five stars. And we'll collect the build. Five stars. All five stars today. I can't complain. We got more emails. We got some daily deals. Anything we want to pick up here? Anything? Hmm. Not really. Not really. Let's check. Let's check on our PC base sales. If you didn't see the episode where we built these, I'll put a link up in the upper right hand corner. You can go check that video out. But so far, our current bid is 551, 894, and 1,151. So we'll keep checking on these until they actually are sold. If you enjoyed this episode, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you get notified as soon as a video goes live. Hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Stay safe out there. Be sure to wash your hands. And I will see you in the next episode.